Techies plus clings, pretty much. So that additional item, you're always on that ever chase for the next item to feel good. As B God is going to be going down. Yep, he gets the high five after, so he goes out in style. Your sign uh, on your blast off. You pair that with a puck. You're keeping heroes in an AOE, mm -hmm. throwing the blast off on top. It just simplifies the team fights early on. But again, Scourge. Oh. Yep, good that's kill. the burn. Yes, they rot rotate people in. Yep, sticky bomb. Soldier's not going to care too much. In fact, he's going to get rebounded off of, but the coil comes in. Blast off. Actually, that was the dispose. Same animation, of course. It is a blink of sorts. It'll lead to the kill onto B God, but Shaggy looks. Be relatively early, first second items. So, you buying a. What's it called? Six, oh. 7k item go. Dispose with dust. Scourge is dead. He's going to get some backup coming, though. Jubei trying to get some collateral, and the coil comes in from Shaggy on the south. And a blast off to finish this. In style, but they still lose. Way to look at it, sure. <laughs> How's your investments doing right now? Uh, your crypto boy? God, no. Uh, Congratulations. We're going to see Shaggy take a tumble here. A nice pick off there for Felt, as they can probably get the tier one tower as well as Zor getting chased out. But it is nighttime, like we said, so he's got that point relative. But in regards to those groups of teams. Yeah, I think he's an up and comer. I put him on the same tier as probably Little Nick. Oh, okay. I'm oh, hoping okay. that like they can get picked up by these teams as we're going to see the Solar Guardian come in. It's going to connect successfully with the Starbreaker onto the Viper, who looks to be mega dead. Shaggy taking a lot of damage, but had his orb out, so Wake Me Up is going to drop trying to pursue him. As the Chakram is going to clip fade and the cut. So just playing gonna be, yeah. with their food right now. Sticky Bomb does connect on the Soldier, who slowed to a crawl. And that's going to be another kill going the way of the cut, who stick around. Most likely a shot as well. I think it's. Probably a reason because he's greedy. That's the reason. As you can see, B God at it again, gets the kill onto Shu, but Zor pops that ult. He's going to try to focus down B God, runs the other way, knowing that he has died. Last two heroes, not the most typical, but you can see the synergy for sure. So, Waning Rift to start things out with the coil only on the one this time from Shaggy, but still going to lead to a kill onto Wake Me Up. Oh, another wasted split. Yep, as Soji in that dragon form, Midas not going to help him tank through this much more. He's going to get bursted down as the buyback onto the Marcy. And Shaggy gets Viper struck and the rebound into the Dispose. But there's a heals coming up from the Solar Guardian. The stun to follow, and that's going to give Shaggy time to get out. Die back onto the Marcy as Fade trying to get the hell out of here. But Rijix is there with the Chakram. And the Cut are destroying in this fight. It is a spin. The Night Stalker. Threat of the mid game. Yeah. No. As we see a coil actually get expended here, and the Night Stalker, look at that burst damage, man. Freezer versus the world and cut. They know that. They're smoked up. A little bit of disconnection. Yeah, well. Shaggy, he finds the DK. Silence to start things out inside that coil. Burning Barrage not going to do a huge amount, but you can see B God coming in to finish the job, as he always does. Really feel like that is going to be. I mean, obviously BKB is needed, but where is the damage on this team? Ooh. That is the main issue. It's basically Razor. Oh, Clink's instantly dead. Yeah, wake me up, done. So Clink's is an ultimate orb, so it will be the Scotty as the coil is broken that sets up the burning barrage. Nicely played. Disgusting combo. She disagrees. She thinks it is wood. <laughs> You can put literally anything there. Oh, Burning Barrage, not going to do too much here. As Zor pops the ult, B-God comes in. Not able to get off too much here as the BKB from Fade. And it's keeping him alive as the chase is on. You can see Zor just focusing on B-God as the Solar Guardian is coming. But the buyback onto the Viper. Shaggy, very low HP. Still with that Aegis. We'll see if he re-aggresses, but considering the Aegis has such a... Like an Scepter. And very a Locket, early. like this. Yeah. He is, uh, in the words of, you know, you, he's a big boy. He's a big juicy boy is what I would say. Coil is going to lead to a kill onto Shu as the cut looking like... In this game, you pick the heroes to do it, but they've just been unable to. Yep, and melee Rax goes the way of Scourge and company. You can see Wake Me Up trying to get something here, but instead he's going to evaporate. It's an item. It's not a hero design. You don't care about Doom now? No, Doom's cool. <laughs> Doom is cool because you gain the skills. I know that Clinks has an, uh, a talent for that, but nobody ever actually uses it. As a last-ditch effort potentially from Felt, as they're trying to focus down Scourge, but you can see he's eating a creep, so he has a ton of HP. He's good to go. He's wet his appetite, so to speak. 
No kills come the way of Felt. They lost the Marcy, so Wake Me Up bought back. They did expend Coil on the side of the cut. Not seen Felt be able to construct any real okay, aggression. So you're saying it's a top hat? It is a top hat. Okay. Well, the cut, going to be pretty happy with that as B-God not able to connect. Oh my god. <laughs> All right, well, there was a hero there before, but Burning Barrage made sure that there isn't any more. So two sets of racks looks like it's going to go the way of the cut. And it's against Night Stalker. He's just respecting the game. If this was any closer of a game, Night Stalker would be the biggest threat to Puck. It's not even about the game. It's more about Shaggy. But him oh, by a BKB oh, on Puck is me. shocking to me. As that is essentially a dieback on the Wake Me Up. And now the final set of racks is what the cut are going to be focusing on. Although they did leave it a range at the top lane. But Zor, even through the BKB, there's enough damage. Fade trying to steal some damage from B-God. That's all he's focused on all game. But the heals from Dawnbreaker are going to be enough potentially to save B-God. He has stayed alive throughout this whole fight. Finally dies, but that's the cost of basically the entirety of Felt. And now Scourge looking to finish things off as a oh, pause a GG. Oh no! You don't want to see this in a in the tiebreakers. Oh, the preemptive boy. disconnect before GG. They are not happy on Felt.